Hi everyone, my name is Victor and I'm one of the authors of Technic.com. Today we're going to continue with our Learn Linux from Scratch series and we're going to look at how to use VI and VIM in Linux. In the previous lesson, we've looked at what um, VI and VIM is. We've looked at um, some things about VI and v VIM. We've looked at how to um, use VI and VIM in insert mode and, and in command mode. So in today's lesson, we're going to look at how to use VI and VIM in command, sorry, in visual mode. All right, so let's um, do some activities. Okay, so in the amazing log, amazing log file that, we, that we've created in the previous lesson, right? I'm going to open this file. So I'm copy um, the first line of this file. I'm going to copy it and paste it, right? So to do that um, in the visual mode, normally you don't have to do that in the visual mode, but I just want to show you how to use the visual mode, all right? So if you want to uh, copy and paste, if, you, if you're not the visual mode type, just do this. Just copy, then um, press your I key, insert key, then go to whichever line you want to paste it to and then you just paste whatever thing you want to paste but to do this in the um visual mode so what you need to do is to for example this line you just um come to the beginning of the line okay either the beginning or the end then um press your v key which means you want it to be in visual mode but don't let it be in, in certain mode so you need to press the, the uh, escape key right to remove from the insert mode and press the V key, you can see that um, the visual mode has been activated, okay? So select this line by using the arrow key. So I'm using the right arrow key, okay? And then when you get to the end of the file, you're going to press the um, enter key, all right? Then you press the um, key YY, which means copy. You're, you're pressing Y two times, okay? And then, um, you're going to press the key P, which means paste. Okay, so um, you've been able to copy and paste in the visual mode. All right, so I'm just going to exit this. The Q means quit, while the exclamation mark means um, exit. So I just want to quit and exit without saving the file. Right. So you can see that to effectively use um, VI or VIM, you would need to um, combine the three modes together. Well, no, no one cares if you're using whichever mode. The main thing is you should know how to edit or create a file uh, with a text editor and do that effectively. Okay, now, so let's um, search and uh, replace a word um, in using VI, VIM. So, for example, if I open this file, right, and I want to look for um, the word U, okay, I'm just going to press the... Um, forward slash key and I'm going to type the command u so you can see that um, I don't have anything like u in um, in this file yes um, Linux is case sensitive okay so let's do it again I know that I have um, u that starts with um, caps letter right so I'm going to press enter so you can see all the all the um, u words in this in this um, file to go to the next line I'm going to press the key N, you see that the cursor has jumped to the next line, the one in green, that's one, um, that's one, okay. So to move to the next line, I'm going to press the key N, all right. So it keeps moving to the next um, available U because that's what we've searched for. All right, so next, next, next. And if I want to um, search backwards as well, I'm going to use the, um, key, um, the question mark key. I'm going to do U, okay? So you see that it's jumped to the next line backwards. I can also press my N key. It jumps to the next line backwards. Then N key, it jumps to the next line backwards. So that's how you can um, search um, a word from the end of the file to the beginning of a file. Sometimes in the file, you may want to replace a word so for example to replace the u the word u to e you need to enter the 
column just look beneath the file here so you enter the column and then followed by percentage followed by s followed by um, forward slash so you want to replace the word you so followed by the word you want to replace with he right followed by g and you hit the enter key so you just need to watch what what will happen all right so you can see that the you has been replaced with he so this is how you can find and replace a word um, using the vi and vim text editor so to delete um to delete okay um for example if i want to delete um the first line or this last line i can use um the command dd you see that i'm, I'm in um, a command mode right now so i can just press dd i've deleted that line to delete another line i can press um dd so i've deleted this line as well d actually means delete all right and you can combine it with um, a word we uh for example now if i want to delete the five words in the first line okay so i'm going to press five right d which means delete w you can see that i've been able to clear the five words in this um file <laughs> all right you can also um undo and um, redo um using the vi or vim okay so to undo an action you just use, you just press the command u you can see that i've been able to undo the action that i've done and to redo an, an action you press the command ctrl r okay so this is how you can undo and um, redo an action this is a class activity for module three so you can just come to the website to um, do this i'm going to be dropping the link to the website in the description section below so thank you for watching please subscribe to this channel and bye for now